In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to install the Laravel latest version on your computer. First, go to the Laravel website. I am going to search by the name Laravel and then you will see that this is the official website. I am going to click here. Then I will have to go to the documentation. Here you see that all the Laravel versions are showing here. Here the latest version is 10. So by default if I go to the installation you will see that here is a command to install the Laravel that is composer create project Laravel oblique Laravel example app. But if you want to install the previous version for example I want to install the 9 or 8 then go to there you will see that another documentation come that is for the Laravel 9. If I go to the installation section you will see that the same command but one change is here an extra colon uh, cap symbol 9.0 this is the extra text you will have to write here here you will have to tell that which version you want to install but I am going to install the latest version so I am going to select the 10.x now from here I am going to copy this line I am going to copy this okay now I will have to go to the location of your computer where you want to install the Laravel. In my case, I am going to the application, then MEM folder I am going to show you. This is the application where I install MEM. But if you install JAMP or other local server, then you will have to go there. I want to install the Laravel into my MEM. Then there is a stdocs folder and here I will install the Laravel. So as I will install the Laravel into the htdocs folder, so I will have to open the terminal in this location. That means I am going to right click on the htdocs, then new terminal at folder. I am going to click here and a window comes. You will see that in this window it is showing the htdocs folder is selected. That means I am now into the htdocs folder. So here I will have to paste the command that I co copied. And here you see that the application name here is given that is example app I am going to remove it I am going to give my application name for example Laravel practice okay now I will have to press enter then you will see that the Laravel installation is started it will take very less time depending on your processor speed and internet speed it is installed on my computer very fast now after the installation is done this documentation is telling that you will have to press this command that means where I am now I am now I am going to clear it you will see that I am into the HD docs folder and here I installed the Laravel but now a new folder comes here you see that is laravel practice that means in this folder all the installation files are given all these files these files and these folders all comes after the installation that means laravel practice in is, is installed successfully now i will have to run this application how i will run this just you will have to go into the laravel practice folder you can go here two ways that is similarly like before i can right click here and open the terminal set here or where i am now in the terminal that is into the htdocs folder so i can go easily into my application folder you see that now laravel practice this one is selected these things they are telling you that you will have to go to the particular folder and in order to to go into a folder you will have to use the cd command that i used here you see cd then laravel practice now i am into this folder and here i will have to copy this code or i will have to write this code php artisan serve make sure that the composer is installed on your computer if the composer is not installed on your computer then the php artisan command will not work so here i am going to write php artisan then serve enter you will see that a server is running 
that is this one it is a development server mainly so i am going to copy this one and in my browser i am going to paste and run you will see that the laravel main home page comes after the installation and here in the bottom side you will see that laravel 10.9 version has been installed so this is very very easy you see instead of running the laravel in this way i can run it in another way that is like the local server in my case the local server is localhost this one and here i can call laravel practice so like all other items all other php files if you want to run any php files into htdocs you will have you just have to write the localhost in my case the localhost after the localhost i i will have to give the port so i just give the port but if in your case there is no port just you can avoid it so localhost then slash then laravel practice this one comes but you see this is not running remember that by default in the public folder there is a htaccess file so you, when you will have to when you will go to run the laravel then after localhost only the folder will not run it after that you will have to give another slash and then put the public if you write like this way then the laravel application will run because here you see into the public folder here there is a htx file so for this file you will have to write the public here so in this way you can easily install and run laravel on your computer i hope you have understood this video thank you